Yo, what's up guys? It's Colt Tech here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to download Dolphin Emulator on your computer. It has to be a 64-bit operating system, I'm pretty sure. So, you can try it with you can try it with 32-bit, but I don't think it'll work. Now, there's going to be some links in the description. There's going to be one to the Dolphin website and one to Microsoft C++ something. Um, Visual C++. So first, you're gonna go to Dolphin MU, Dolphin dash MU dot org, and I'll put a link in the description for this and this Visual C++. So, um, you're gonna go to here and the click on this button, and the one that I think works best, like the one that I got working, is. Hold on, let me find the right page. View older versions. Okay, so you're going to have to click that. And I'm going to go to the one. Okay, so you're going to need build 9616. That's the one that I got working. So we're going to go all the way back, all the way back, in, until you see 96. And then you're going to look there. And it's going to have the 16... So the 90, this is the build number right after like 5.0, so 5.0 dash, the build number 9682, so obviously we're, obviously we're going to go down, and looks like we need to go page over. And you might need to do that a couple times, oh, here it is, so this build right here, right here, so you're going to, if you, you can download it for Android or Mac OS, but if you're doing it for Windows, it's, 64 bits only I'm pretty sure I don't know if the older versions are 60 or 32 bit but so you're gonna click this download button right here and it'll download a file down here okay so I have it set to save right here I'm gonna save it to my desktop just to make it easier and then that's done so once that's done you need to go to download visual C++ and this link so you don't have to go up here and type it out um it's gonna be in the description uh, i've already said that so um you're gonna come down here press download and if you have 64 bit or this whatever but 64 bit so i because i have 64 bit so then you're gonna click next and it's gonna download the file um so it's gonna download it i'm gonna put it on my desktop and I already have this installed, so it's going to give me a little error, but you can go through the installation process, okay? Um, now that we're done with that, we can go back and it's on our desktop, these two things. And what we need to do is first download this um, because the Visual C++, it, Dolphin needs... Dolphin emulator needs C plus needs Visual C plus plus to run. So you're gonna double click on this. If you have it already installed, that's great. But I have I have it already installed, so I'm not gonna go through the um, installation process. I I'm hoping you know how to do that. So I already have it. Now I'm gonna click close because I already have it. But you'll have to go through the setup. Okay. So after you've downloaded visual c++ um you're gonna actually need 7-zip or winrar i'll put links in the description to download 7-zip and or um winrar so i like to use winrar but i also have 7-zip extract to dolphin master 5.0 96 16 64 bit yes so it's gonna take a little to extract gonna take a moment and I'll see you when this is done extracting okay it's done extracting so we're gonna double click on it and inside of it there's a dolphin 64 folder and on that we're gonna double click and then there's dolphin.exe you're gonna want to run that and now you have Dolphin successfully installed on your computer. I'm going to show you that it works by opening a game I have in my Coltech stuff folder. 
Okay, so it's opening um, a Wii game, and my controls are kind of messed up, so um, my controls, they're messed up. I don't really know how to set up the controls right, so we're going to have to figure that out, but like I don't have Bluetooth on my computer, so if you don't have Bluetooth on your computer, then you can't use a Wiimote, um, but... It, this is Super Mario Bros. Wii. Um, so, yeah. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. Smash that bell icon so you never miss an upload. Peace out.